So are you thinking of moving to Gwinnett County, Georgia? Well, in this video, we are going to explore the highs and the lows of the heart of Georgia, Gwinnett County. So let's get busy. This is your first time to this channel and you want to know everything about eating, sleeping, working, playing, the good and the bad of everything Gwinnett County and the surrounding areas throughout Northeast Georgia and South Carolina, then subscribe below, tap the bell for notifications so that you can be the first to know about the current market in Northeast Georgia. My name is Melissa B. Bacall, also known as The Selling Bee, and my team and I get calls and emails every day from people just like you looking for help on making their move to Northeast Georgia and the Western Upstate South Carolina areas. And we absolutely love it. So whether you're moving in nine days or 90 days, give us a call, shoot us a text, or send us an email. All that information is in the description below so that we can help you make a smooth move to the Northeast Georgia area. Gwinnett County is the jewel of the Peach State. It's known for its Southern charm, diverse communities, and of course, the sweet Georgia sunshine. But like any place, it's got its own set of pros and cons. So let's break it down. First up, let's talk about the pros of living in Gwinnett County. One of the best things about Gwinnett, the sense of community. There are tons of local events, festivals, and farmer's markets that bring people together. It's like one big happy family, y'all. Now let's talk about the food scene. Gwinnett County is a melting pot of cultures and that's reflected in its diverse cuisine. Whether you're craving Southern barbecue, international flavors, or just a good old sweet tea, Gwinnett's got your taste buds covered. Now, if you're an outdoor enthusiast, you're in luck. Gwinnett boasts some beautiful parks and recreational areas. From hiking trails to sports facilities, there's always a way to enjoy the great outdoors. Now let's talk about the flip side. So every rose has its thorn, right? First up on the cons list is traffic. Gwinnett County has some serious, they've seen some serious growth, which means the roads can get a bit crowded. If you're not a fan of bumper to bumper traffic, you might want to plan your routes strategically. Another thing to consider is the Georgia heat. It gets hot and humid, folks. If you're not a fan of sweating through your shirt, just walk into the mailbox. <laughs> you might need to invest in some extra deodorant. Lastly, let's talk about schools. Gwinnett County has a lot of great schools, but like any district, it's important to research the zoning and find the right fit for your little ones. Well, there you have it, folks. The pros and cons of living in Gwinnett County, Georgia. It's a vibrant, diverse community with its own quirks and charms. And as always, it's all about finding the place that feels like home for you. Thanks for joining me today. And if you enjoyed this episode, hit that like button, subscribe for more adventures, and comment below with your thoughts on Gwinnett County or any other places that you'd like me to explore solo. So again, if you are looking to move in nine days or 90 days, be sure to give me a call, shoot me a text, send me an email. And until next time, I hope to see you around town.